<clears throat> Hi, um, nice to meet you. I'm uh, uh, I'm Ryo Suzuki. I'm a former PhD student at the University of Colorado Boulder, and then now an assistant professor at the University of Calgary. So today I want to talk about uh, reality sketch, embedding responsive graphics and visualization in AR, in AR through dynamic sketching. So this work is a collaboration with uh, Lubayat Habib Kachi, uh, Lee Wei, uh, Stefan Debold, uh, Will McLee, and Daniel Leitinger at Adobe Research University and the University of Colorado Boulder. So uh, this paper presents reality sketch, uh, augmented reality interface for sketching interactive graphics and visualizations. So reality sketch enables a new way to embed and dynamic and responsive graphics in the real world. So the user can quickly sketch on the iPad and bind them with a physical object in real time and in improvisational ways so that the sketched element can dynamically move with the corresponding physical motion. So this paper contributes to a set of interaction techniques that enable cache varying, parameterizing, and visualizing real world motion without predefined programs and the configuration. So uh, let me quickly go through the overview background. So the sketching interface research in HCR is the best, which starts from the IVA on the sketchpad, but um, um, there are a vast majority of the interactive sketching and the dynamic sketching, which the sketch elements are going to be animate and that change based on the user interface, user, user interaction. And then the recently more and more work have investigated the how we can integrate the sketching interface in AR, VR, and mixed reality interfaces. So if we categorize uh, uh, existing work, we can see this kind of uh, the history, one of which is a static or responsive, uh, which is uh, the sketch element is going to be changed and animate. Another one is a uh, separated or embedded, which is the sketch elements are presented and spatially integrated within the real world. But to our best of knowledge, not so many work have investigated this intersection of the embedding and embedded and end responsive sketching interfaces that leverage both dynamic sketching and the AR or mixed reality interfaces. So, uh, uh, so that's why the, uh, we uh, uh, this paper presented reality sketch, which is uh, trying to investigate the very first uh, the interface to combine these two. So reality sketch is an augmented reality interface sketch, uh, sketching interface that uh, is based on uh, Apple AR kit, uh, uh, that which is which works uh, iPhone and iPad. So with a reality sketch, uh, when you sketch it, and the sketch elements are gonna dynamically move and uh, based on the physical motion or your or the tangible interaction, so that you can directly manipulate uh, the sketched um, element in an AR. So reality sketch workflow are uh, composed from the, the three workflow, one of which is object tracking, and then the sketching and parameterizing, and then finally parameter binding or visualization. So for example, uh, if you uh, select the color on the iPad, then it's going to be uh, tracked on the uh, AR screen. And then if you can sketch it, then the sketch, uh, sketch element is going to be automatically bound to the real world object so that you can actually, you know, just um, the sketch this kind of object. And then the, uh, you could also define the, the variable or visualize it so that uh, you can combine, combine, you know, the sketched element um, to make more expressive motion. So we have investigated uh, the four different types of application, which is augmented, uh, uh, augmented physical physics experiment and explore concept exploration and sports training and analysis, and then in the institute tangible user interfaces. So please refer the more detail in our paper. Thank you.